Hi YouTube, this is Rose. I'm making this video to share with everybody that when you do things online, everybody can see what you're doing and saying, okay? And just because you block somebody does not mean they cannot see what you are doing and saying. Okay, I would like to go to, uh, I would like to read to you a comment from Laura. I'm not going to read the whole thing. She's talking about how she's Dutch because somebody said she's very manly, I think. Let me see what they say. Uh, she doesn't like this guy because he said something at the very beginning about telling me to go, that I was going to hell. So everybody else who trolled her, she was kind to except for that guy. But what I want to show you is that, we'll start right here. I didn't like men finding me beautiful, which like is a little rough. I'm just old. He he, LOL. I'm not at all butch. Well, this woman is very tall, very large, very big feet, very big hands, very big head, big, large, everything. Okay? So... When you see a woman that's really big, usually that, that word is used, come to one of my house meetings if you're Christian. Now, to come to one of your house meetings, you have to completely agree with everything she says. Read her books and all this other stuff. Okay, you have to be saved and read the lost story because it's the power of the end time move lie. And I'm not going to hold meetings with milk drinkers, lie. Just not. Just not. There's plenty of churches out there for the milk drinking saints. Anyways, thanks for the laughs. I'm all woman. But I did have cancer and chemo treatment in my 30s. And God only knows how ravaged I am by that and whatnot. But having been told I could win a Miss Universe contest when I was in my 20s. Okay, ladies, I got a question for you. When you were in your 20s, okay, in your 20s, everybody is hot. You're about as beautiful as you're ever going to be. Men, the most common pickup line is, are you a model? So, I know what kind of relationships Laura has had by witness that have been there in her life she has always picked or she did before Sean before she met Sean she picked party animals she hung out with people that drank and partied and I will bring proof of that later on in my videos as a Christian so uh, and as a Christian so not being comfortable with being considered beautiful Old and frumpy works for me. I like it. Which like, as I said, is being pretty critical of a granny. Now, she doesn't even see her grandchildren. You have to be uh, have a relationship with your grandchildren in order to call yourself a granny. But it's an, it's an improvement over she's drop dead gorgeous. As I had to suffer in my 20s and 30s. I didn't like that. Okay. Okay, so now we're over here at Laura's Facebook, and I would like to address those people that have been speaking to Laura and uh, speaking about uh, other people and what they think of other people that they've never even met. Now, Ezekiel, I tried to warn you, but it looks like you just think Laura is the cat's pajamas or whatever that's fine that's your choice you'll find out the hard way but I want to let Natasha know I've never once said anything bad about you Natasha but you got you love to say things like she's a man that's slander there's a law against that Natasha you think I'm somebody else how do you know where is your proof? 
I don't have to pretend I'm somebody else. I make up another channel so that people that block me, I can see what they're saying. So just let it be known. Natasha says, P.S. I believe that real prostitutes don't love men. They service. They're just doing it as a last resort. Is that what you do, Natasha? Is that your problem? Is that why you hate men? Asking a question, Natasha. You love Laura so much? You think she's all that in a bag of chips? But she can call anybody, any name she wants. She can say whatever she wants. Well, let me tell you one thing. Everybody on YouTube, everything you do and say is being recorded. And you think you might be able to hide and block people? You can't. You cannot. Y'all better repent. Y'all better repent from following this craziness. Are you serious? How can you even call yourself a Christian? This woman believes she's Mary, mother of Jesus. She believed she was Eve. She thought she was Stephan, the Apostle Stephan. Doesn't that make her a transgender? Wow. Really, people? You're really going to follow that? Wow. May God have mercy on your soul.